going to be how to grow your dressage or any really club. First, you want to spread the word. Go out to people, say hi. Are you interested in joining a dressage club or a jumping club? Um, are you willing to get the club horse and outfit? Um, next thing is just have a lot of requirements. You don't necessarily need Discord. It's kind of good to have an Instagram. I don't have an Instagram, but it's good to have an Instagram. Um, just so they can like get updated if they don't log on. So I'll just get updated on what the book is. And in the same six months. Um, the next, like you want to have a lot of requirements. You want people to know that you mean business with the club. You don't want it to be a messy club where it's just like, oh, you know, you know, oh gosh. Um. This club's oh, not named Bad City Games. <laughs> That's not very family friendly. Games, <laughs> Games are not acceptable. <laughs> Don't join one place. I'll kill somebody with a gun. But basically, just don't be a messy club. Don't have don't have everybody wearing outfits, different outfits. Make sure everybody's wearing at least simul some similar outfits or exactly the same outfit everybody needs the same kind of horse or if your club requires it the same color you need to have a strict coach um for dressage now this is how to go to dressage club but this can work for jumping and cross country and star stable but you just want to be strict. Usually a coach that that does not talk in all caps is not going to get any work done. But if you get work done by not talking in caps, it's fine. I'm not like saying you need to yell at them. You just need to talk in all caps to make sure they listen to you. Make sure that you have often practices. Make sure you tell them when they've done something wrong because if you don't tell them they've done something wrong or anything, then they're not going to learn from it. Don't, the next thing is don't be afraid to kick people out of the club because if they've done something wrong and you feel bad about it, they're just going to keep on making like mischief in the club and you don't want that. Again, all this explains everything be strict with your club like not too strict so don't be yeah you just you want to be polite and kind but when something happens you need to say yeah yeah, but I think that that's a lot of information for right this second and for right now. So I think that this might um, be the end of the video. And, um... You. <laughs> and, yeah, bye.